can draw the sun or the stars and the moon. I can draw anything. How about you? Ready, set, draw! Hi, my name is Evgenia Nyberg and today we are going to paint the bear from A Bear for Bimi. Ready, set, draw or paint. First, you're going to need a marker, a paintbrush, the watercolors and a container for water. First, we are going to start with a circle, which is a bear's head. We're going to add two ears, which are upside down U shapes. And the body looks kind of like a teardrop. And the arms, they kind of look like sausages. And we're going to add cute chubby legs. I'm going to make another circle for his feet. And some squiggles for his toes. I'll add some little fingers as well. Let's move on to Bear's face. Let's draw another circle and a little upside down T for his smile. And I'll finish with a little nose. And now we're going to add two eyes. Two little circles for the eyes. And we will fill them in halfway, like two little moons. Let's dress the bear up. I'm gonna draw little pants and a little pocket. And a very important detail, the big blue bow. I'm gonna draw another drop shape. Then one more. And let's finish with some ribbon. Now we're gonna start painting and use the watercolors. So we will mix the color for the bear I like to mix two different colors. The golden orange and the mandarin orange. We will paint in little sections and change our color just so, so the bear's color is a little different. Let's add a little bit of brick red to the orange as we move down to Bear's body. And let's add a little bit of orange again to mix it together. Moving on to another arm. Again, starting with the brick red and gradually moving on to orange. Now let's paint the bear's legs. Let's go over the bear's feet and then we'll come back and finish the feet when the paint dries. That way the colors wouldn't bleed into one another. The bear's face has already dried, so we can go back again and use some of the darker color to create the shape. Let's do the same to the ears. over the arms
And now we have to wait for the paint to dry until we can move on to painting the bear's little outfit. Now it's pretty much dry, so let's continue with a different color. Let's choose some beautiful blues. We're gonna mix a couple colors together to create a more interesting blue. And I'm going to start where it's dry, right here. We're going to keep mixing different colors in just to make the colors more interesting. You can choose your favorite blues or greens or whatever colors you like. Just have fun with that. I'm choosing my favorite blue. Again, let's add a little more blue and a little water to help the paint spread a little more. And you can paint with any hand you like. I usually paint with my left hand, but sometimes I prefer my right. Now the bear's outfit is completed, let's paint the little feet. Let's choose some darker brown so the feet stand out. Let's paint the little toes and the little fingers as well. And now the final touch. Let's paint the beautiful ribbon. And for the beautiful ribbon, let's try using several different colors. So it looks like it's almost shimmering with light. So let's start with some green. Let's add some blue. And let's find some slightly different blue. So it looks like it's all shimmering, almost like the seawater. How about this one? Now, let's start with the green again, and let's try to be super careful, especially if you're not using your dominant hand. some blue and let's have the green and the blue meet in the middle like so Just as a surprise, let's mix a little bit of purple into the blue for the second ribbon. Every time you paint, it's great to have a little bit of a color surprise. And ours is going to be the touch of purple. Oh, that looks nice. Do you guys like it? Let's add some finishing touches and give a little more depth. And this is how you can do that. You can go around 
following the shape of the body with darker color and then using some water to mix that color into the rest of the outfit like so let's finish the ribbon on the bear and his magic pocket And that's how you paint the bear from A Bear for Bimi. I can't wait to see what you painted. Share your painting with us by using the hashtag ready, set, draw. I had so much fun painting with you today. I hope you did too. Bye for now.